what I got. Hi guys. Oh, Darcy's here already, and she's the one farthest away. So Darcy's far. Darcy's in California. So far. Yeah, I should. Unless Annalise comes, then she takes the cake. Oh yeah, because she's from Norway. She's from. <laughs> you know what she did? She made uh, a video of her books when she got it from us and opened everything. And look at this. Look at this. Can you hear us, guys? Let us know if we need to bring a. Uh, the sound closer. Yeah. Let's see who I help if I put we my have on my Karen. Hand. Deborah Long's Deborah here. Long and Dara, Dara, of course. Yeah. <laughs> we said of course at the same time. So hi, hi Donna. Hi everybody. Yeah, Donna's here with Jeffy us. Jeffy Lou's here today. In our kitchen. They're having another fun time. And maybe and if you don't Macy's remember this when you see her you'll remember maybe. I well most of you in here never were around I don't think when she was. Who likes to color? I love to color. Oh, you're trying to get me started here. Yeah. yeah. I love to color. Yeah, we're going to color today. I have I adult coloring books. Oh, okay. Well, we're, well, gonna we're doing a different kind we're of not, coloring That's today. right. We sure are. Keep that in mind, too. We're going to... We're gonna. Uh, but this is just as fun. Okay. So, I'm going to... Um, I don't know what she's looking for. I just, I just thought I'd tell her. Tell them I stopped by to pick up a Mona oh, Lisa. Oh, she because stopped by to... Yeah. You want to see what Donna got? This will be Donna's unboxing video. No, I'm just like crazy about these silly Mona Lisas. And when I wear them, sometimes my friends that like them so much, I just hand them the whole thing. Well, I did that a few weeks, months ago. And then I panicked because I thought, I hope I could get these again. So here's what I got. They look there, right? Yeah. Don't see. Right place. You should have to zero it's in. I, I love it. You want I'll to place it down for a second? Yeah, I love it because... Um, she looks suspicious, like some. She's got a secret. She okay, does, and I'm it's fun. Some. She's got a secret. Yeah, that's been, sorry guys. Okay. Look at that. I just not glued in places. Now that it's one so is cute. the glass one, because I used to get the German decal one, but then yeah. I make them in forty by thirty and more, so I get them made in glass cameos, and they're pretty. Just like the blue willow one, can't get them in forty by thirty anymore. So I get them made, and it's the same picture. Okay, I, good. Thank you, guys. The I think it sounds good. good. Yeah. I think okay. It's nice, cool. We, have we can hear Cherie's you. Cherie's here. Oh, Jennifer's Cherie's gonna here. like this video because it's about Simon Hurley products. I think Cherie was the one like Simon Simon oh, Hurley. Okay. Jennifer's yeah. here too. Woohoo! Yeah, Simon Hurley is the genius behind solar paste. Now we have lunar, lunar paste, paste, which is which is this stuff. This stuff. Yeah. But we have a new product. Yeah. Now, lunar paste is, it took over for Inca Gold, if you remember Inca Gold, which I loved. But it's got all the best properties of that and more. So we're very happy with that and it costs less, which is even better. Okay. So we have that. We've got this one, the same size pretty much as really mm -hmm. lunar paste. Same yep. size. Yeah. Same size. The only thing I found yet is this stuff. Uh, Which this, is two ounces. Okay, so can. this is probably about the same. Yep. Yeah. This stuff is going to last you a long time, people. Yeah, you only use the tiniest You bit. use almost none. And this is what it does. Yep, she said it was her. Cherie. Yeah. You're right. I thought so. Anyway, so just to kind of give you a point of reference, um, I'm going to move them over here. Same kind of, I don't know, you can't see them. Oh, well, you know, it's don't, okay. don't worry about it. Anyway, so I didn't bring a big piece up, but I, okay, this is matte black. We can see it now. If you can, can you zero on that? No, but matte black, yep. can you show what they look like? Yep. All right, okay. So that's matte black from beastofatiques.com. And it's a finish that we have applied to the raw brass. Very See, pretty. That's the peacocks you can do that. that bent. You know, you can do that on raw brass with paints too. But the commercial finish is a little bit nicer, I think. Um, anyway, so it's very flat matte. You know, matte black, beautiful. But when you put it on the solar paste on the matte black, look at this. Isn't that unbelievable? This is the blue. Yeah, it's the beluga. There, I have six colors now. There are more, but so I'm gonna start this out with one. Six. Hey, Andrea. Hey, Lisa. 
We got Cassandra. Cassandra's here too. Andrea, Beans. Awesome. Yeah. I didn't know if we had as many because I didn't make as big a deal about it because it was over the holiday and that, and I just don't like to make too much so, of a hoo ha then. But like it's over, so time to get back to work. These, is that only yeah. for metal? Huh? Is that only for metal? What? Oh no, this is a scrapbooking product. Wow. But here, let me then show you the difference. So, plain solar paste. Yeah. yeah. Okay, if I get coffee? Yeah, come get your coffee. Okay. For casual. And our, and our coffee today is the today. Starbucks, okay? Well, Starbucks like Veranda the Blend blonde. blonde. This means it'll kick your pants. This, I could only get it in ground. But this is about the only one I'll drink in ground. It is so good. Oh, no. And if you need a little bit extra jolt of energy and creativity. Oh, man, that we talked about good. last time. You're, you're kind of going to have to water it down. Don't I? I don't know. I like it. This is like. What am I going to do? It's yes, really it colors so well. And you're going to see, guys. So it's it colors different. So when you do it on the black, you get the slight hue or that tint this kind of reminds me of people with like that blue black hair you know how they have that natural yeah, like blue tint yeah but if you do it on something lighter like if it goes on something white or mm -hmm. lighter and we're gonna color, find out because i'm gonna do it because right she's now. gonna do it i've got a whole last. bunch of stuff here i only did this one yet it's a little more so this is i'm, pigmented. Gonna, I'm gonna use the this is beluga isn't it? yes i'm gonna use the same thing beluga this is satin gold i got this one because we have a lot of it and um uh, all I'm doing is, I don't even have a, you know, a dauber or anything. I'm just sticking my finger in there. It's, it's non-toxic, water-based, cleans up great. No, and the smell is, is probably too much. not bad either. No, I don't smell like, like You don't have to worry anything. about chemical smells. So I don't know what this is going to yield. I'm thinking this might give us like... We're experimenting together. Yeah. Oh, this is fun. This might give oh, us kind of a here. shabby gold looking with it. Yeah, she... It's gonna have to dry for us to see. It doesn't show up as good on the lighter pieces, but maybe it's because of the color I chose. We'll try another color. I did put plenty though. But yeah, you know, and you can put it on as thick as you want. If you want to put it real thick, then do it. But I might put a little more in the middle. But you can see, you know, you don't want to put too much. I think it might look nice on the brass ox. Well, that's gingerbread. Yeah, no, I'm, I, was, I, I have, was looking to see I if you wanted to try on the gingerbread. Yeah. I wanted to try this cross my heart because it's kind of a pink. Mm -hmm. And I thought make it might make it look more rose goldy, maybe. Oh, so guys, when you go, real quick, when you go to order this, okay, so all of these in the jars, like, let me open one to show you, they are all white. They are not, they do not look yeah, like they have yeah, color. Yeah, thanks for bringing that up. Yeah, they, they look like what's she talking white. about? This yes. is these are defective. There's nothing. So no, you have like to choose one. by the color. You have to read what the colors are, but look at the labels. So mm -hmm. whatever the label is, that's the color that you're going to get. So this one is like a pinky kind of like rose type color. This is like a sagey green. This one, of course, as we showed you, is the blue. I'm putting this over top. This of one blue. is like Let's a gold. We have a purple. Um. What other color? We, there's like seven colors, six so or seven pretty. colors, right? There's six. There's well, six there, there are actually more, but I only have this many to so begin we with. So have, we have like all six colors. No, so. no, there are more than that, but I don't get That more. I saw. I want to see how they go, you know. Yeah, this looks almost like a shabby whites type thing with the gold. Um, now, I'm going to see on this black piece, let's see, what does this look like? This is that's the green one. Green crocodile tears. You know, I should take them out <laughs> my fingers. Let me go back here. I actually have a sink. <laughs> All right. Pink paper towel. Is that too strong for you, Jeffy Lou? Oh no. It sounds like Jiffy Lou. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to your coffee. The reason we're back out in the kitchen today is because we have excellent light out here, don't you think? I just think it's a fun place and to it's be. It's a fun place to be. You know, the kitchen is the hub of the home, they say. Oh, sorry, guys. Hopefully that stops. Um, what happened? It's saying that it's cutting out. Oh, no. Let us know if it stops, guys. Is it because I'm standing here? No, it's <laughs> not. It, it happens sometimes. I have no idea why. It's not our Wi-Fi. It's not mm -mm. none of that. You have any no, it might be YouTube. It. Rob used to always tell me I broke it with my face. You broke it with your face. That's what my Rob said when he was little. Debbie wants to know if you seal it after it dries. Yeah, you should. 
Um, I would use, because it has a slight iridescent to it, um, I would, this is the green stuff, Crocodile Tears. Um, I would use like... Oh, this coffee so good. Um, yeah, it is good. It's I, so smooth. I don't know if you'd want to use a matte crayon. You might want to use a satin to keep the shimmery thing going on. The gloss. Yeah, so I'm just going to take one of these. This is dry. Let's get you in the yeah, get mm -hmm. in the frame here. So, and I'm just going to kind of brush this out so it's even. Now, when that dries, it will be very interesting. I mean, I kind of have a glimpse of what it's going to look like, but you won't know entirely till you know, it's done. I can't wait for the pink. So now, I'm going to do this one. I only kept a few of them because, you know, I didn't want to keep them. Has that green. So here, this is the Cross My Heart, which is a pink luminescence. And I thought that might be a good one to try. Now, all I had that I could, why don't I have this? Let's do this. I want something. I didn't really want uh, a filigree. Okay, so we'll do this one. So you can see how it gets in there and it gets in the cracks kind of so if you don't like if you don't want it to like pull up you know pull p-o-o-l that, that's a beautiful like um, that. into the cracks this is one of my favorite stampings because it's such a great focal and do so many things with it. i've used it in so many colorization videos i use it in a lot of the inca gold ones as a matter of fact okay so this is what it says guys the solar paste it's a creamy white paste within a metallic color shift when it hits the light. Mm -hmm. So, okay, I got this backwards, so my bad. So it's subtle on white, but then when you put it on something with more intense color, like the matte black, for mm -hmm. instance, like on black cardstock, it's saying, because this is for like mm -hmm. um, scrapbooking, then you'll see intense color. Mm -hmm. A lot of scrapbooking products products I've brought in over the years because they did had perfect pearls. That's what they did with that. Is that but uh now this Oh this, Annalise is on. Hey Annalise, how you doing? And she said it's good there, I think she said. So maybe good. it's okay now. I hope so. Someone just, said that it reminds them of mica or pearl paints. Oh beans did. A little bit. Um I would think because of the shimmeriness it does have mica, but you know perfect pearls is mica powder. And, you know, we could get not quite this look, but, you know, we got a real pretty, it was just a little bit different effect, mm -hmm. but it was messier, I thought. I wish they could see it real close. Well, they're going to when I'm done, because we're not overhead. Yeah. Okay. I don't know, maybe we should be. Oh, I can try to be. No, I don't want to interfere with what you're no, saying. I just think that's so pretty. And I It would be nice if they could see it overhead. It looks okay, like it was aged one. like that. It's see, so when we do it cool. in the back, everything's overhead. You never yeah, can see me. Yeah, it is. But we thought, well, I'm maybe that, I'll... maybe people thought that, like, maybe uh, something happened to me or I got face disease or something. <laughs> I'm afraid this is going to cause a wardrobe malfunction to move this. No, it's not. <laughs> so can you see that? It's almost got, like, a rose gold effect. I'm telling you, that is pretty. To it. Now, when this dries, it will be even more so. And yeah. then when it dries, if you think, like, it should have more, then you just put another mm -hmm. layer on, you know? And then when it's all dried and really super cured, then that's when you would want to go ahead and uh, seal it. Yes, this is the crocodi uh, crocodile tears. Yeah, let me hold this yep. up so you can see it. We were waiting for it to dry a little bit. Yeah. I might add a little bit of something to that, but see, it's getting quite, it's kind of like, uh -huh. you know those bugs that have that iridescent shine? Like the beetles. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of mm -hmm. reminds me a little bit of that. So I'm going to, I'm going to try, I wonder what this is look all about now. You want to do the, the pink on the black? Okay. But yeah. I, but that's I want to, I want to try a little something here. This is going to okay. be kind of crazy, but I'm just going to go around the edge with this. Oh, with the rose? Okay. Yeah. I'm just see. You know, this is what's so fun about colorization because... It's a time of discovery. Sometimes, you know, happy accidents and all that. This is a good time to have a happy accident. This, this one, Beans, this is the blue. Yeah. If that's the one you're talking about. Otherwise, Brenda's working on the on the green one right now. She's adding a little bit of the rose color to it around the edges. 
Um, I was checking price wise. Ours are six ninety five. We can't afford to sell them for less than that. Really, we can't afford to sell them for that, but we are. Um, I checked Amazon. They were way more there, but that's because they figure in their shipping on them. Well, here's the thing, you know, at a certain level, you get free shipping from us too, and mixed media product is heavy. And when I buy it from this supplier where I got this stuff, um, they never give me a break on that. So it's basically, I get stuff like this to go along with the brass. And hopefully we sell a little bit more brass in that way. Because, you know, effects is so nice to change it up. Like, a lot of people have seen brass stampings before. That, that's prettier than it seems. It is. Right there. In person. Yeah. yeah. That's very, very pretty. It's very glowy. Can I, I would do mm -hmm. that. Yeah, I was waiting for it to dry a little bit. Let's see, it looks better when you dry it. <laughs> okay. Sorry, guys. We're doing well. <laughs> and we'll function. Okay. Okay. So that's I'm pretty. I can't wait to see the pink on so that black. Let's see, there's the... There's the Rub pink. it hard so you, you can, can get it in the cracks. It? Well, I'm um, sure I think you say it's a hallmark of Michael. Well, you know, mica powder is in almost all the makeup you use. I don't know if you know that. I'm allergic to it. Eye shadows. That's probably why. I know. I can't wear them yeah. on my eyes. I won't. Yeah, they kind of make my eyes bother too. When I was younger, not that they didn't. But yeah, that's why, like, if you have old eyeshadows that are gone, you know, you don't want to put them on your face anymore. They're probably in you probably can, some you can use base them. powders, too, You can right? use them to, yeah. Like in the foundation It makes lumin base powder. makes luminosity. Better it was on our brass, I think. Okay, so now here's the thing that I, I found with doing um, Ooh, the I'm film. I'm not in there, am I? I just want to see. No. It. Yeah, you can. I don't want to. But be no, you're not on camera. You're not I'm just trying to stay away. Look at I'm this. I'm going to zoom in, right? I'll hold it I'll pay you we haven't too. had Donna in a video for what eight years. Hi, Mary. Maybe? They had enough of me eight years ago. No, they did. Where's Mary? We are oh, colorizing today. Jennifer. We're coloring in Bisu's yeah. kitchen today. So you can kind. Of, I think I might have to pull a little bit more because it's filigree and some kind of leaked through the back a little bit. Yeah. But anyhow, let's Ooh, look that's look. pretty. So it's like at first it's it's subtle and you think, oh, I don't know. We're I don't we're know. finger I don't painting know today. I don't buy that or not when it dries and then too i haven't tried it like if i did lunar paste first let it dry and put it over that but that'd probably be unbelievable okay so let me show the difference here so i just got this stuff guys so diane Di diane just put it up so there's no black on this you can't put like like make it look antique rub it in copper there's nothing well black. you just use black paint okay, okay so here is gingerbread itself okay untouched Bisu put the rose colored solar paste on this one. I like that. And when it dries, it'll be it'll be rose goldish. Mm -hmm. That's what it'll look like. Especially if you add a little bit more mm -hmm. too. So. Now I have to wonder if I put some this pinky stuff on this gold piece, is it gonna turn rose gold? It might. I never did get my brass ordering, guys, because I had more to pay than I realized. But um, I'm making it this week because it's all taken care of now, and uh, I'll be sending it in. So hopefully, we'll have it sooner than later. And if you don't want to finger paint and use your fingers, you can apply this. With oh a yeah, brush. get something yeah. else, you know, whatever. No. I just, it's just so easy. Yeah, I mean, it is. Yeah, it, it, and it wipes right off. It, it's so easy to get it off your hands. It's not. It's, it's nice to use before a formal event because it makes your fingers extra attractive. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah see that? Look at this. <laughs> He's putting it on a finger now. I like this stuff. Yeah. I really do. And you put that on the peacock and it looks like it's like a peacock feather. Yeah. It makes oh, it, you know what yeah. you should do with that? It's very you know pretty. Should, you should put the purple around the edges. Yes. Yeah, you should put the purple around I the edges. I don't have a purple. Yeah. We, yeah. I said we didn't No, we do, but I didn't open all of them. Oh, yeah. Okay. But no, afterwards, you should, I can't you should keep do them the purple. All. I can't. You know, that's so beautiful, peacock colors. No, can, I'm, I'm talking yeah, after. The purple will be amazing. We have a purple And then maybe a little bit of the blue. You should do a little bit of the purple and a little bit of the blue. Yeah. I just came over here to get it off my fingers, guys. I'm sorry. I made you so cold. You didn't do anything to I'm going to stop. So there we go again. I'm going to show you guys. She added that little bit of rose on top. Yeah, I love that. But I we think might, I might take we it. We might tweak it and add some blue yeah. and purple to really give it the peacock look. Now, here's, I thought it would be fun to look at 
a couple of pieces of raw grass where there's no. Ah, no yes. Nothing. Annalise wants to know if this would work on chain. Yeah, would it? I was thinking that. I don't see why not. It just You'll might have get to messy see a little bit in between. Well, the it could glurp up, but then what yeah. you have to do is when you put it on, go back and take your little filmy brush and like dry brush it and get it out. How do you clean this up? Water. Yeah. You could use your little your little needle point. If you use a regular too, to yeah. like if you yeah. use a regular paintbrush, you can daub it and, you, and you keep could do working with it. You can do all kinds yeah. of stuff. The links will it, be clogged. It might be better to use like a like a thin brush with mm -hmm. chain, yeah. just so it doesn't get so globby. I wouldn't. But oh, really? Mm -hmm. I'd use my fingers definitely. Oh. That way you won't get as much on it. You can always go back over it. You, and then what you do is you take it and you draw it through your. I'm just a piece of chain. I'll get it. You there's can find little, me a little piece of chain. There should be a little scrap on the actual table. If there's okay. a, yeah, if there's a little, if you can find a little piece of bait and link, I'll that would be it. good. Just, we're going to see. Okay. So, anyway, I'm going to try this pink here on raw brass and see what it looks like. As you can see, I mean, this is going to last a long time. Mm -hmm. The main thing is, in between colors, you want to get it off your hands because you don't want to pollute your jars. Yeah, it might get a little muddy looking too if you do that. Yeah, it might. It Although like it might look really pretty if you mix the colors too, because you can mix oh, yeah. the lunar paste and make yourself you a go. new color. Um, you want brass? Yeah, we need brass or brass socks for it to work best. Or a little piece of like matte black. Okay. Yeah, that would work, or gingerbread. The silver, I don't think, is going to do too much. But you know, we could try it. What the hey? Okay. Yeah, that, it does look a little whitish on the screen. Which but I have you know, the, but, the rose gold on here. Well, that's because there's it's not dry in the cracks there. Yeah. How you could see that? See, it's gotten. Yeah, there is a purple beans. There is a purple there's one. We just don't have it out right now. Uh -uh. I just I kept four of them, and then the next order I'll get a couple more of those so I can keep them because. Yeah, I can't keep all of them right They're now. in the what's new section on the I site. I think we got like nine bottles of each one, and I kept a few, and the rest of them, they're selling already. So, and then I can always put another order in. Hi, it, June. It doesn't take long to get in here. It comes pretty quick. They dry quick, Mary. Like minutes. Probably. Well, the, for You know, quick dry, I would say. Overall, if like. If a quick dry, but dry. I would say before you use it. Well, see, they can use Before you wear it or, or try to seal it. Look at the difference here. This is raw, and that's with the pink on it. Can you see this? Mm hmm. And see how rose goldy it is? And it's not dry yet. When it dries, it'll be even more so. Mm hmm. See? So if you like that rose gold look, boy, that this, uh, what's it called again? Let's see. Cross my heart, be a good one for you. Here she comes with a whole wad of chain. What are we going to do? I have reasons for this. Don't, <laughs> don't mock me. Anyway, I found this, which is really too small for any purpose. Well, I might be able to do But this is that. nice. In fact, I might okay. buy this when I'm done. Okay. See? Is that the last of it? Mm-hmm. Okay, we well, had to make sure Diane knows that she could take it off. Well, I will. I'll be real responsible about it. So I'll just do the <laughs> end of it in case you don't like it. So yeah, I would put I would put my chain down. I have some videos on how to colorize chain, by the way. I'm surprised mm -hmm. you don't like my t paintbrush idea. You hurt my feelings. Oh, stop it! <laughs> Break you know, it up! Break you know, it up! It's, it's I'm gonna drink coffee now. It's it's, <laughs> it's about yeah. The old Brenda and Dawn are back. Hi, um, Colleen. We promised that we wouldn't do this. There's so Colleen. Yeah. Yeah, oh, Mary wants to know. Can you use this on bone? Why not? Could we use this on the bone beads? Yeah, I'm doing it after I colorize it. And I'm glad you brought that up, Mary, because you know what we're doing next week in the kitchen? I ate an extra Tootsie Roll when I was out there. I don't care. Okay. That's just a Tootsie Roll they won't get done. Well, since you're buying the chain, we'll, we'll let yeah, it go your this time, Donna. Too. Your customer, too. <laughs> okay, <laughs> getting back to Thank what I'm long. doing. Um, why was I talking? I don't know. The bone, what we're doing next week. Oh, we're, we're going we're gonna to show you how to dye bone with Kool-Aid. Are we going to do tea, too, or just Kool-Aid? Uh, probably cool, Lee. Okay. And I'll do a few ahead of time, so then they'll be dry, and we'll try some of this on there, too. I bet it's going to look spectacular. Over top? So, you wanna, so you're saying if we want to do the bone beads with this to dye them first? Yeah. And then do and this then as, dry. like, a little sheen over top? So this is what I would do, guys. Okay, Annalise, here we go. I don't know, you know, wrong or right, whatever, but this is what Drum I would roll. do. Drum roll. <laughs> 
Uh, this is what I would do. <laughs> Thank you, Donna. <laughs> From me to you in Norway. How's that, Annalise? Isn't that amazing? We can have a friend in Norway <laughs> visiting with us in, in my kitchen. Oh, I'm sorry, she's saying, okay, I'm going to bring it closer. Maybe that'll work So better. right now, it's just looking really white, but that's because it has to dry. We're going to get it on both sides. Oops, wrong finger. It does look better than I thought it would with your finger. Yeah. Well, see, I, I'm not done. Okay. I just thought it was... It's, it's the better night. No, it, yeah, that's what I'm saying. You're like, right. it's less goopy than and I thought yeah, it would kind of, be. I thought for like sure. Like, in the lengths. Dry yeah. brush it. Now, what you have to do is when that's dry... Just hit it with shellac spray. Uh, yeah, some Krylon... Yeah, like uh, that. I, I meant that. Krylon satin or yeah. matte. And then what you have to do with chain... In case you don't know this, anytime you paint chain, you have to take it out. It's going to get kind of stiff. So you have to take and kind of break it up like this in between the chain. Oh, I see you can't see me. Kind of just wiggle it All around. All right, break it up. Break it up. Break it yeah, up. Yeah, break it up. Like I told you So guys, when it dries, it'll get, I don't know if it'll dry enough for i I'm going to take a piece of Donna's chain and mess it up. Not much. I won't pay for it. <laughs> The Donna's back. No, I'm not. Yeah, she is. I'm behaving. I'm Jeffy fine. Lou. What made you pick that name? Did you know somebody by that name? I thought it was ridiculous. So I, <laughs> I, like I it. thought it was ridiculous and no one would know who I was if I put that down. And we I figured it out kind of quick. The, the, the car she part. Ru she people. ruined it. Jiffy. I'm on yeah. Jeffy. Actually, that's what all, some an old friend of mine used to call his wife. Oh, really? Yeah. It was okay, that might be pretty, Sheree. She's saying the purple might be cool on the gingerbread. Yeah, what? Absolutely. Oh, Ginger's here. Is Ginger here? Did I see Ginger? Did you see? No, no Cherie. She, Cherie that's Cherie. Cherie said the purple might be cool on the gingerbread. Oh, without, grass. A, without a doubt. Anything like rosy color, I'm purple, blue now. would be good. You know what? Why so, so I don't know. Because we got it on know. a white top. Uh, yeah, I, I, you know what, though? Even when I pick it up and I look at it, I don't know. The toast dry. It's just gonna. That's gonna be the tail because it's so fine and delicate. So we're just gonna have to wait and see on that. Probably if you had a heavy roller with thick chips, or you know, if you had um, some of that uh, book chain that's real fat. Like, do you still get yeah. that in, Brenda? I buy a few times a year. Usually when I have a special. So nice. It's hard to get. It, it's so it's it's expensive, and it just went up a dollar a foot. They're so all the chain is going up, and I can't buy it direct because I found the manufacturer, but they had some kind of agreement probably with the guy who sells it to me, <laughs> so they wouldn't sell it to me. So, yeah. That's lousy. Yeah, well, what are you going to do? This was just loose in the box. I don't know how she's going to figure out what I owe her, just randomly. Yeah. She's good. She'll figure out something. Okay, so that's what I had for that to show you. Um, just because there's anything else here. These are pretty. This would make a pretty pair of earrings. Okay, I'm going to let you tell me. What color should I use on these? These are matte black. I have crocodile tears, which is green. I have... Do you want me to go get a purple? Check my... No. Okay. Check my oh. heart. Not till I get another one, cause I okay. I, I want to have them for them. For them. Then I, um, I got gold. Can we try the gold? We haven't tried the gold yet. Could we make the flowers one color and the leaves you, another that's color? That's where you'd need your paintbrush. Yeah. To do that. Uh, don't yeah. have one. I don't think gold's gonna look good on that. You do? No, I don't. Hey, you know what? Let me see. Let me see. I think put all the colors on like the peacock colors. Okay. If we're gonna do, I use the paintbrush or. And just do like a little bit of like the rose on the flower and then the leaves. You can do that with your finger. Yeah, Use your baby finger. Well, I think I would get a paintbrush in a case. But you know what, Sean? Do whatever you want. It's the paintbrush controversy your going on here. It's your, your stuff. Know, right? It's your stuff. Do what you want. On the chain. Not on the chain. On this Just one. remember. <laughs> just, you know, this, is, this would be a good time where, you know, sometimes you guys say, oh, I want to back through my stash and see what I already have, you know, before I buy any. I'm like, well, yeah, that makes perfect sense. <laughs> but I'm like, oh, man, you know, I need to make my paycheck this week. But you know what? Yep, Kool-Aid. This is a time <laughs> when it would be really, really good for you to go back through your stash and see what you got and then experiment. Because then you could do all kinds of crazy stuff and it's not going to matter. 
I love my there's stash. There's too many cooks in the kitchen today. <laughs> Who said that? I am. Because <laughs> all the controversy, the too many cooks in the kitchen. <laughs> okay, so I just put gold over black. I don't know what to think. We are Dara's very excited about bone beads and Kool Aid next week. Of course. Yeah, and put this on them. I'm Do you imagine? You, folks, you get that? That was not on a white piece of paper. We see what's well, going on. Then I'm gonna go find something. I'll be back. All right. I'm gonna. Oh, my nails are not gonna let me pick that up. <laughs> so let me. Okay, so that one she put the gold on. You know, it didn't look half bad. And it is golden hour is yes. the color on that. Because, again, remember, guys, when you're getting these, they are all white. Yeah. So let me. But, you know, when you look at them, there the is book. a different there is sheen, a, but it's yeah. very, it's, very subtle. So you might think, you like, got to see it, like, what's person. up? What's up with this? It's all the same so thing, yeah, you, you can know? See it's it's all not. Like a white base, I should say. Right. All a white base. So you have to go by the label colors. So, again, this is the green. This is the gold one. We have the rose there in the back, and then we have the blue. Yeah, butterfly PT. I was talking about. But there that are more colors. Right. There's two more colors. There's a purple, and then. So this is lunar paste. Yeah, it is full pigmented. So color. you can see how different. Here, I'll put one. On. You see this this stuff here is it's metallic, much lighter. The feel of it's much lighter. This is heavier, thicker, body, which is just like ink or gold. I swear it's the same thing. But I thought maybe I would take a little bit. No one's gonna like me right here. And with lunar paste, you can no, you probably can with the solar paste too. What are you too, doing, but, my Bessie? It'll be all right. But I know <laughs> from fun. experience that you can mix the lunar paste and create your own color. Yeah. Like, I took the blue. Before we had an actual purple color in the lunar paste, I actually took the blue lunar paste and the pink lunar paste, and I mixed them and made my own purple shade. Now we have a purple. That's yeah. but, right about that. So, but they mix very beautifully. Okay. That's good on the white, though. I, here's a little brown thing. Uh, okay. You know, just I'm for, sorry. I, I just painted you. It's okay. I'm not, I'm so why did you bring the picture out, Don? I like it. <laughs> just, shall she's we, getting distracted. Shall we share it with me? I have ADHD. It was a distraction. Well, no, you could look at this. I don't want to get paint on it. because you're. I'm but sure. I just think it's so cute. I don't think that's going to show A dear friend gave me this. I found a bone bead. Not Donna. This is a real Bessie P. Scottman, so it is a coveted piece. I, I covet it. She gave it to me, and she was an antique stealer, and I said to her, She probably felt sorry do you, for you. Do you know what you're giving me there? And she goes, no. <laughs> I says, well, I'm not going to tell Keep you your now. Mouth shut. Oh, look at that. Give it to me. I'll fix it. Dara says that Butterfly PT works great on bone beads. Too. Yeah, it does. It's very subtle color. Oh, she brought me a bone bead. <laughs> Donna brought me. She's like a little magpie. She, she's like a cat that brings you... <laughs> so here's, here's a bone bead. Okay, so this is what it looks like with the green stuff. The way it is. Not this is so anymore. fun. I, wish, I hope they could see all this stuff. It's just oh, she's amazing. not. She wants to put it on tissue. I just give you options for another. Oh, here. That might work for this piece. I just, it's just options. Because it wasn't working on the brown. And You'll it probably delete like, the whole thing and I just because I'm... We can't. Doing. It's live. Oh, so much pressure. No, we don't do that. I told you not to let me on this. <laughs> Where am I putting this? I'm trying to I put this I don't know. What are you see. doing? Okay. That is a bone bead with crocodile tears on it and no patina. Now, different I way, like it. Different ways you can get patina on bone, as you all know. Because we had lots of fun with that years ago. Um, good old straight up strong black tea. I love that color. In fact, what about that's coffee? My, I got coffee. Coffee right too. And and you know, I think that's my favorite of all because you can go back. Could you imagine like the, give it like two days and some black tea? Yeah, it's fun. Then rinse it off, let it dry real good. You and then, yeah, no one else then a little bit of that on it. Yeah. This Woo! is this is the rose color, Dara, on the black. That's really that made warm it look almost gingerbready. It's really beautiful. Yeah. It's just, you know, how things can get changed up. Mm -hmm. Now, this is lunar paste. Let's see if it's tacky enough. I can 
So I want to put a little. Yeah, that solar. shows it off better than on. You have to put a little so, bit of solar all right. in there. So here, this is a smaller piece, but so here's a, just a plain matte black filigree, and then there's the one that's showing up nice with the rose on it. Mm-hmm. There's the chain. Just I'm so you can kind for. of see the difference and how it changes it. Donna said she's going to get in here and interview I'm going to take, I'm going to have her not charge me for the end with paint. I probably won't charge you for any of it if you just keep just the mash it. I can't. I'm going to get charged double. I, get, I give a lot of things away, ask them. Oh, you guys are lovely. I shouldn't even harass you because it's not fair. Okay, it's so. It's just fun. There they are. Start out with lunar paste. Start out with lunar paste, guys. And then let dry a little bit, and then I put the beluga on it. So let's do this. Let's show what that looks like next to this. Many years ago, I saw Catherine yeah, this have is earrings lighter. for sale on Etsy, and she used different colors on the metal. And I don't yeah. know what she used. And she's I just, a paintbrush. Yeah, I loved Acrylics. it. Acrylics. I loved it. So no, she's pretty. good at it. She's I can see this it. being a new thing. And also, this is stuff would be good on cameos. Hi, Michelle. Oh, yes. Michelle. Hey, Michelle Flores is here. Okay, so I will show you the gold, guys, because it's dry now. So there is the gold. You know, the that's kind of cool. Which like we black actu gold. It's we cool. actually have that chain that, is it the diamond cut yeah, chain? Yeah, that's, that's black, black with the gold. gold. Yeah, that would be cool with that. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, this is fun. Yeah, you know what? I was wrong about that. That came out good. I like that. So, again, what's good against piece. your hand? So you I'm can in see love with lunar paste. I use it all the time now. Very yeah, it's a good one. And then with the gold. And you I don't like need so tons. This, this. this product is so rich. Uh, pigment rich, just rich body, full body, like Donna Starbucks coffee. And, you know, when you this is way better than use it, it just don't need as much. You Jeff says she's in love more. with the lunar paste. She yeah. uses it all the time. Yeah. So, anywho, so I have... Oh, yeah, Cherie says that it, they're like metallic watercolors for surfaces. Uh, oh, and here's what I was thinking about that, too, because I know they're like... that flower um, you got over there? This is a, this is a paper bead. Can you show it? Mm -hmm. You guys see these. You know this. Um, for the, I'm going to put the other over here. We are going to have another video on Friday. If all goes well, it will be a produced video. Diane's working on it really hard. She's doing a good job. It's almost made. And we're going to be doing the tassel necklaces, which I will show you in a minute when I'm talking about. This is one of those paper beads, you know, that we made in that class. We just wrote paper. So, anyway, I'm going to take a little bit of... The rose? Yeah. On this. I just see, this is paper, of course. I love this black paper. Oh! Oh. Do you see how you just barely dab oh, your finger on the top man. of that jar? You can see where this stuff was, you know, made from paper. This would be great on your rice paper stuff. That you do but do you see how, finish. like, it's going to last you forever. Because you, do you see that? She's barely I, even I'm touching. I'm using anything. I'm a oh, nada. I'm like a, something like that that you can use. You know, we're all like to but mess like, with everything, not just She's barely even, like, putting her finger oh, yeah. down, like, on the surface. And Does it dry out easy? Yeah, well, no, no, it's no, not like that. No. If you put the lid like, on, you know, like, yeah, oh, not like that other stuff that goes paste, bad. It, it dries out, so because you can reconstitute it, it has its place, and we carry yeah. it again. Yeah, and, I still have you know, some. I still believe in having it. But I love this. But this, this is, is this because is, this, this is, is not. like a cream, it does, you know, it's. Yeah, I like that. I really do. It kind of stays. Yeah, I can't wait to use this on some. Um, I want to make terms out of epoxy sculpt. Oh. I'm gonna put this on there. Oh, Oops, sorry about that, guys. We got. I well, I think maybe we sold out of it. I think more black epoxy skull. Put this on it. Oh, oh, oh man. Mm -hmm. I had so much fun today, Brenda. Well, I'm glad we're not done yet, though. <laughs> she's playing with the cat over here. The cat's on the chain, dangling, and she's, she's over here really winding it up for us. No, I'm not. I just. Can't. We used to get really wound up. I'm didn't not. We? Oh, we're good today. S I down. am not. Uh, I I I don't. Mean Some of to those say old videos any, I mean take off. I say just about. So well, you you're fine. You, you can't, can't take. Can me. you guys see that? 
Can you see I that? Was it's all got a little stuff, French print on this paper here with some little Frenchy mm -hmm. words. But I did the rose over it. Now that is already heavily Mod Podge. It's relatively hard, so I have to use it. You know, put my end pieces, which we'll be talking about that on Friday or whenever that video comes out. I'm trying to see. Oh, there Look we go. That. Can you see, Can that? You see that? How beautiful. Oh, man, I wish I could. Okay, so can it, do you, let me, do you have another bead that I can, okay, so here's just, oops, the regular paper, right? Okay, and then there's the one that has. I what? could I I'm could be like really bold. Bit. I have this made. Okay. This is already made. What if I do? I'm, I'm going to be really bold. Okay, this so is regular made. paper, untouched. I'm going to put and it And then on this here. is the one that has the rose on it. Can you see? I'm trying oh. to get the right angle on it for oh, you guys. Oh, man, you guys got to do this. See, this is what makes your stuff that you make different than anybody else's when you learn how to do this. See, I put... This is a finished tassel, and I just put it on um, this one. This, paper piece. this this piece I put it on too. Yeah. Okay. That's one's gonna be on Friday, Friday. if it gets up. Yeah. I think it will. She's doing. Yeah, good she is. She's in the process of editing the video, yeah. so we already pre-recorded. So just trying to fine tune the video. Yeah, that's pretty. Cause it already had a rose on it, right? That that's a rose in the uh -huh. in the paper. So well, it's just the one from the video. Yeah. The other, yeah, but they don't know what it looks like. The original yeah. one I sold, which I did show it in the video, but it's gone now. So the paper so had a rose design on it. This rolled paper yeah. bead. It's just little scrapbook paper. It's not too. Yeah. But it's not heavy. You can't you can't use a real heavy paper with it. it just doesn't roll right. But because she had that rose design on the paper already and then she added the the rose color to it yeah, that's pretty it makes the no, rose it, you know what this light doesn't show this off but i, I took it, it the daylight and it and it really just got a little goopy in one a couple well, things because we don't have the brush to, but this is pretty it has to dry first and you just stress it but this mary is mary's saying. loving this piece with the gold yeah you know and that was the one i don't know if i want to do that i don't, I don't think it's gonna be too good that's awesome just shows you got to try stuff, right? You just got to go for it. Yeah, let me bring that back in. Do we have a favorite one of these? Of what? Of these? The color? Um, I like the blue. Uh, yeah, so I like the blue. Although the green beans. The, the rose the gold bean. one. The I, mean, you, I wish you guys could really see it on that paper V there. Oh, they think it's gorgeous. It's going to sing. Now, you won't see that on the video on Friday because I didn't have this stuff then. But anyway, I got this one that we did, and I have this one for this. What people wanted is when I put these together a long time ago for the uh, lace beads. It's kind of hard to show them off because, you know, they're so long. But um, they wanted to know how to do this. Get this layer, these beads here, layer like that underneath. It's so easy. When you see me do it, you're not going to believe it. So you guys got to be sure you see that video. And tell your pals about it. No, Jennifer, this is all the solar paste. Yeah. So the only one that we did a little bit of the actual lunar paste on are these ones down here on the bottom. She put a little bit of the blue lunar paste, and mm -hmm. then she put the blue solar paste over top. That's not helping. I just think I it's pretty. It's pretty. You can't, well, get, you it's can't. very delicate. But all the other show. ones are the solar. So this, whoops, sorry, nothing. I can get it with my fingers. This is the gold solar paste on the matte black. This is the blue solar paste on the matte black. This one is the crocodile tears with then a little bit of the cross my heart the pink around the edges and then the gingerbread has the cross my heart mm -hmm. solar paste so they're all the solar paste and that's what Visu put on the beads as well and on mm -hmm. the paper beads yeah it's the solar paste so yeah it's it's giving that iridescence that ab sheen 
Uh, uh, this is really shaky. Illumin- shaky. Illumination. <laughs> Illumin- illumination. Uh, yeah. This is really shabby, shaky. So what color is that? I did the 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 gold oh. on the brass. So it's like on the raw like brass. gold on gold, but around the edge I did the crocodile tears, give that green gold look. Okay. This is pretty, pretty, and then I could probably go back. Do the little and give pink. a little dab of the pink. Is that the one you like, Mel? <laughs> Millie's here. Millie's over here giving She's her opinion. She's complaining because no one's paying attention to her. Okay, so when that dries, we'll have to see what became of it. Oh, and then, okay, one more. Jennifer, here is the cross my heart, the pink rose color on I'm the black. matte black. Yeah, I'm black. I forgot we did that one, too. Yeah. And so these really have It kind of gives it like a peach. It's kind of yeah, like a... Yeah, this is very rose gold now since it's drying. I will take a picture of all these. And I'll put them in the newsletter, which I didn't get a newsletter so like, done today, but I'll have you have one for tomorrow. You can see the difference. This is plain matte black without anything on it, and mm, then that's what there is. It's like kind of like a peachy kind of color. Yeah, kind of, a little bit of an A B, more like an iris. I'm talking to the cat. Oh, I thought I thought her door. He is here. Yeah, more of an iris, I would say, Jennifer. Um, so that's pretty much what I had to say about these today. I, besides which, I think y'all. She's get saying some. maybe try it on a lace bead. <clears throat> okay, well here's a lace bead. I would do this the rose one, would or the gold. The rose. Yeah, it's pretty. You have to put a good bit on though because it's because um, it's fabric. Well, yeah, and because it's. You know, lacy. It's going down in kind of. Yeah, that'll work. It's probably going to work on just about anything you want to try. All you can do is try it, right? <laughs> Cherie says, delicious. Delicious. Delicioso. <laughs> Don't eat it, though. <laughs> so, you guys, before we take off here today, I want to remind you. I need your comments under the video. These are great. They're great because it gives us a conversation and makes things more interesting. But the ones that count are the ones, when this is over, you go back and leave a, bit, a nice little comment underneath the video that is published. YouTube counts those and it can boost my rank and I need that desperately. And you guys are the only ones could do it. I can't pay any kind of money to get that done. And it doesn't have to be some long no, thought out. Yeah, you can say hi. You can just hey, say, I watched. Hey, we had fun. We had fun. You fun, know, whatever. whatever. Or if you have a question, go ahead and post it because yeah. I answer everybody. I totally, it might, might, might take me a little while, but I was thrilled we had close like to 40. Close, Close to, close to 80. Was it 80? Yeah, but I think okay. that included when I answered them. Okay. But So that was still pretty good, and we had a lot. Of, so you want to hit the like button, and you want to hit, uh, so you can't see it that much, but maybe yeah, once it's no. dry, you will. But yeah. it doesn't hurt anything, that's for sure. Um, you want to hit the like button, and leave me a little comment. You just have no idea how it happened. You know, I don't know if I told you this little story, but I, you know, Colleagues of mine in this business, I they have they're creators too, and they do they're really really good teachers. They do a fine job, and I don't see where they're doing anything better than I'm doing. But they have all this going on, and they're boosted crazy. And it's like I know you can't pay for that, so how? And I started noticing all of the comments. Their following leaves them comments, and maybe it's because they're not live. Because when it's not live, it's easier. You just go over and you just do it. With this, you kind of have to come back and do it. But if you would do it, I'd appreciate it so much because that's what's going to help us. It's like, I don't ever expect to be any big shakes in this business. After 13 years, it ain't happened yet. It's not happening. But I just need to be able to stay here. So that's how you can help me do that. Just It's free. It costs you nothing except a couple minutes, maybe. So if you do that, I very much appreciate it. So don't forget to like and leave a comment. If you're not subscribed, I think most of you here are subscribed, but if you're not, um, by all means do it because, and if you click the little bell that's next to the subscribe thing, YouTube will notify you when I'm on because I'm kind of on a little bit of er erratic hours now. You know, we kind of don't have that beat going yet. We're here at a certain time. So anyway, so you might want to know that too. Anyway, wasn't this fun? These are on sale at the website. 
They're, Mary. Yeah, Mary, they're on. You can look at the What's New section. Go to Shop the New Stuff. They're all on there. And um, if you want some, I don't, you know, I never know if they're going to go fast or not. I think we're just going to ponder it or what, but they're not expensive. I think there are six left of every color right now. Um, they sell down. I will go get some more because it's just not, it's not hard to do it, you know, this fast. It doesn't take very long. And I know I've not had a lot of new things for a while, but the reasons for that. So I will be having some. And this was the first one for this year. Is a solar, right the end of this year, is a solar paste, and I think you're going to love it along with the lunar. We have a good bit of lunar in there, and we have those new decoupage papers, which are beautiful. So, you know, if you're into, like, doing all this mixed media type stuff, you know, have a ball. They're not expensive. You could load up, and don't forget, we still have that 20 for all discount. What is 20, what did it do, break? No, but something is... Oh, that's what happened. Okay, there we go. Mind. There you go. Sorry, guys. 20 for all. 2-O-F-O-R-A-L-L. -L. 2 0 F O R A L L. Same as last time we did this. And we still have that till the end of this week. And this is the last week for free shipping at 50, guys. So if you want to take advantage of that, we knocked that down a few months ago from 100 because that's normally what it is. And has been for years. We knocked it down for a while for the summer. We're going to have to put it back up because they're raising the shipping along with the price of a lot of things. So in order for me to keep the cost down to the bone, to the minimal amount that we can afford to sell it for and still maybe give you a little discount or a perk of some kind because I know everyone expects that and likes that and that's the fun part. Um, the free shipping will be at 100 after this week, after the first of the year. Not because we want to do it, we will have to because we can't absorb all that. So anyway, um, keep that in mind. If you want to be able to try just a few things, come in and get yourself the lunar paste and solar paste maybe and get it shipped free. That, that would be pretty sweet. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, so we have a little bit of a latecomer, Sarah, and she is wondering hmm. what solar paste is. Solar paste is this stuff. From Mr. Sam and Hurley. It's, it's a, a white base. product, and it's like a mica in a very, very pale white paste. They all look whitish. They all look it's whitish a white base. Inside. So you want to look by the label yeah. Yeah. for the color that it will turn. Yeah, and really, all you have to do, Sarah, is um, use just, the tiniest. Uh, when tiniest this is produced, bit. when I mean when it's not produced, when it's all processed. Just roll back and watch the video. Skim through it. You'll see what it's all about. You'll learn all about it there. So, um, yes, it's a lighter yeah, texture, Jennifer, the, than the lunar. Yep. Well, we just got it up yesterday. Oh, and then someone had asked if um, you had tried this on the silver plate. You know, I haven't. And here's my feeling about silver plate and putting color on it. It's all up to you because it's your money. However. Because it is I a pricier said that plating. Silver, silver or silver plate is extremely expensive. And that's why that brass costs so much more. It's costing me close to $100 a pound now. And to give you, put a face on that, that would be... Okay, see I have this piece. And that silver. would be... That would be... Um, Maybe 18 of them would be a pound. Okay. So you put silver on that, you divide that out, ouch. So I'm saying that it might be better unless you just had to, just leave it alone and enjoy it the way it is because it costs so much for you. But hey, once you buy it, if you've got a, an idea that you want to try, then it's yours, you can try it. And here's the thing about this stuff. If you put it on and you don't like it, go get a wet rag right away. Yeah, and you can get it off nice. if you do it quick. Okay, Sarah, I'm going to give you a little demo. Watch Scott Nouveau talk. sealant on the side. I've worked to seal this. Yes, it would. Um, so I'm out of it right now. I'm hoping sometime in January to get it again. So, I'm, so I don't have it right now. But, you know, um, honestly, I think your best bet would be the Krylon or, you know, matte or satin spray stuff well thank you for sharing it 
Lunar is more pigmented. Yeah, it's 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 a paint. This is more like just a additive thing. Yeah, Lunar's a paint. So, well, thank you for wanting me to stay here too. What you can do to help is very, very simple and doesn't cost you anything. Just go make a comment out on the front side of things underneath the video. And the more that YouTube sees that, the more people they'll show my videos to. That's how that goes. I can't even pay to have that done. That's all about viewers. This is the green one. She's going to put... I did some blue, and no, now I'm adding a little bit good, of green. Huh? Your nails look oh, green. Oh, thank you. Do a little bit of green over top of the blue in the center. But yeah, it's You're super very easy, welcome, Sarah. Beans. Tell your friends about us. Do whatever. You know, but it's a colorizing product. Anything that you're comfortable with doing to tell people about us, please do. Because it's just gone to a place where I just I get frustrated to see these other ones doing well and I'm not. And there's no reason why I should not be, except that okay. I'm just not getting people to leave comments. I guess I don't. I hate to ask, you know, but if you wouldn't mind. It matters. Just so you can see the difference between the blue and the green. But yeah, this is all you do, Sarah. You just, it's a colorizing tool and you can use it on paper, like for scrapbooking and you can use it on metal. Yeah. And but, it shows but, up better on darker things, but so if like she, on matte black. But is, if she rolls back in the video, we've done that yeah. too, on bigger pieces. So you can rewatch, which so, I showed yeah, her. You'll know easy. Just so you can see how you apply it. It's Paint with super your finger. Easy. Yeah, you can use your finger. You can use a brush. I like these things. I'll let that dry for a minute, and then I'll show these you. These little foamy brushes are dirt cheap. Get like ten for a buck, and like. And it wipes off with water. All these or something. Super easy cleanup. Yeah. yeah. I really think that's beautiful. I yeah, really, really I, like, I can't wait to make so, something out of them. Again, this but for was, now, i got to take pictures when they're all dry so that I can show them on my newsletter tonight. So, again, you want that little piece of my regular chain I'm gonna buy? gingerbread. Yeah. So you can show that. Untouched. Well, it's not showing up yet. And so. then this is the gingerbread, and we added just a little bit of the rosy color. So it turned it more rose gold. Mm -hmm. You can even add more to it if you wanted. You can see the gold in it. Mm hmm Again, this is the matte black. But with the blue. Thanks, Darcy. It reminds me of people that have that blue black hair. That it has that bluish tint like to it. I like that hair. Mm -hmm, me too. This is the matte black. That with was gold, the sleeper. I did not expect that. Which would look great with our diamond cut black chain that has a little bit of the gold in it. Yeah, that would. I should have go This is a lavalier chain. too, and then you just. Yeah. Yep. This is the one that Beans likes. This is the crocodile tears. This is matte black, and it has the crocodile tears. That's the one we used to cut and then the for rose. earrings. Yeah. I love that. Mm -hmm. But we're thinking, because she used the crocodile tears, Donna and I want her to go back over this and do a little bit of blue and do a little bit of the purple to make it really look like peacock. This is what we do with in case you wonder why it's bent. She's going to make it. Makes a great bracelet. bracelet. We have a number of videos That's great. showing how to do that. I think my favorite one is when we do, use torch patina to make it. It looked just I like love brass ox. torch patina. <laughs> Mary like says she one. she can paint with her fingers. Good old finger painting. That she passed that with flying colors in kindergarten. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah, super easy. And me then too. this is the matte black again, and that's with the rose. So it yeah. gave it that like peachy color. Oh, Debbie got some. Woo woo. Good for you, Deb. Which, All right. Someone said this would go good with the color of the year, that peach fuzz. Maybe, yeah. I like that. There's a green that's really pretty this year, too. Is there? I have yeah, to go they're, look they're at They're pretty colors. I'll tell you, I got people a are divided on peach fuzz either. Now Nobody that this died, dried, I'm okay. Not, I like it. I'm not This a is the regular piece. This, too neutral. This is the piece that it looks like, the raw brass. She colorized it. different, though. And now look Who at the difference. That? Yeah, you, this shows up good. She but wait, used, that's another good video to get a peach fuzz uh, video. And say, okay, here's the colors that go with it. Look how this works. Yeah, yeah. Here's the colors. So she used the gold on this. Gold and, and crocodile. And a little bit of the crocodile tears mm -hmm. around the edge. Around the edge, yeah. Well, it's nice to be able to see how products work yeah. before you buy something. Yeah, it's it really is. really nice. It is. That's like why that. the internet is so good, yeah. as you can show. But you have to teach people how these days. And that's okay. That's my pleasure. Thank you all for tuning in today. Mm -hmm. You're great. So I think we're going to take off. Mm -hmm. I think we got her covered.
please be sure and leave me comments. If you have questions, you can leave that in the comment. I will answer you. Or come to the group because I'll be posting this video on the creative group. If you don't know about the creative group, you can join. It's free. Um, you'll meet some wonderful creative friends there that may be your friends for life. I know I have. So come, it's on Facebook. Be Super Teams Creative Group on Facebook. And I believe there is a link down in the description to that. So just come and ask for admittance and then you get in and then you have fun. Fun, fun, fun. And again, this is at bsubatiques.com. Look in the new section, the what's new, and you will find all of the colors that we have available. And that is my website. And yes. there are thousands of things in there. You kind of got to get a cup of the Starbucks coffee and come in there and take a little time to see because we have goopers of great stuff in there. I Where fall asleep I? looking to it. Okay. Donna says she falls asleep when she comes, so <laughs> I might too. I don't know. So you fall asleep, I mean, wake I up, and keep no, walking. Time. Not because it's boring, but because no. there's so many it's pages of things. It's relaxing. <laughs> well, people have told me it's overwhelming sometimes, which is sad. You can no. shop by color if you want too, which makes it easier. We've moved some things to Etsy because people say they can find them faster there because it's a smaller store. But if you really want to mm -hmm. see. What all we have? Yeah, you can shop. I don't have trouble place. on the site. You can shop that's by category, shop by color. Site. And there's a really nice search box at the top of the homepage. All you do is put your word in there and show mm -hmm. you everything we have. So it's like your own personal shopping assistant. So okay, I'm gonna take off. Hope you guys like this. I did. Mm -hmm. I did. I did. I enjoyed it very much. Fun to have Jeffy Lou with us. Yay! Oh, you guys are sweet. <laughs> I'm, I'm so 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 that'd be great. Oh, with, with pleasure. So anyway, okay guys, until next time, um, I will let you know when the next video comes out, which will probably be Friday, and then next Wednesday, mark your calendars to come back here around the same time, and we're going to do Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid bone beads. Dying beads with Kool-Aid. Buying, dying bone beads with Kool-Aid. Kool and we do have bone beads at the, at the site. site, and I have some yeah. more to sort through. I think you get two ounces. Worth of so it's enough to mess, it's so enough yeah, to mess it's enough around to... with, and I'm going to get in touch with what's his face, Robin from over in India, my pal that gets them for me. So he goes to these different places where they make them, and they have seconds, and there are nice things in there yet. We don't have to pay as much, so that's all good, right? Mm -hmm. He says, could, could you use it? I don't know why not. Just try it. You can use it on paper, like it's it's made oh, for scrapbooking. Oh, definitely, definitely paper. Definitely it's paper. used for scrapping, which we did. On the paper bead. Mm -hmm. That's beautiful how that just shimmers. Ooh. But you can use it on metal yeah. as well as we showed today. So. Okay, guys. Gotta go. Love ya. Thank you. And uh, have, have a really great day. Okay?